Since making part one of this video, I've had so many DJs contact me asking if I'd found a solution that I realised the problem is far more widespread than I'd first imagined. I spoke to loads of DJs about the issue and checked all the forums that I could and finally came to the conclusion that the problem had to be the upgrade to El Capitan. Serato seemed to leave everyone hanging and the best I could find was a statement saying that it should be fine and everything should be working. Sadly though, that didn't seem to be the case for the DJs I was speaking to. I then made the decision that seeing as the problem couldn't get any worse, I'd just dive in and upgrade to Sierra and see what happened. This is when I realised Mac got back to their old tricks and the mid-2009 MacBook Pro that I'm trying to fix has now succumbed to obsolescence and is too old for the Sierra OS. When I used to do a lot more web design and online advertising, I used to run parallels on my Mac so I could have one side for PC and the other side for Mac. This got me thinking and I realised that the best solution now would be to partition my hard drive and install an older OS on one partition and keep the newer OS on the other. That way new items like iPhones will work on one side and another stable side to run Serato on. Because I've come up against these types of issues before, I decided long ago not to upgrade the OS on my Studio Mac Pro and have kept using Lion to this day. Once I have a stable setup, I try to keep it that way for as long as possible. So what I'm gonna do is buy an old version of the Lion OS from Mac and install it on a partition of my hard drive. Serato should then work perfectly again and this partition of the MacBook will be like a doppelganger mini-me version of my studio computer. So here goes. First things first, let's download Lion. Now that I have the Lion OS, I will partition my hard disk on my Mac. Be very careful if you're thinking of doing this not to wipe your hard drive and make sure to follow the instructions very carefully. So annoyingly, that didn't work either. I tried loads of different things, but old technology with new technology, it just, it wasn't happening. So now I need to figure out a new solution. But while I've been doing that, Serato have released a brand new version, and I'm hoping that seeing as it's been so long, they've actually solved all the problems. So what I'm gonna do is install that onto the laptop now, and then do a test mix and see if it's fixed it. Fingers crossed. And now I'm installing Serato onto the laptop. Now that I've got Serato installed on the laptop, it's time for the fun bit, the test mix. Let's 
seems to work perfectly. So Serato have sorted it all out and uh, everything I did and all my work was in vain. But at least it's fixed now and that can be my backup DJ laptop again. Amazing. Hello. I was well. Hello. Subscribe, 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 subscribe